Hey guys, how's it going? This is one of those videos of those random awesome fish catches that you get whenever you're out there fishing. Sometimes it's catfish or a walleye or a bass or a spoonbill like this one ends up being. Uh, it took us about 35 minutes to get reeled in, so the video is going to be a little bit longer. I uh, couldn't quite cut it down. You know, it's so much exciting, so much fun. So it's going to gear towards whoever wants to watch the whole video, watch a beautiful sunset, or if you want to watch just the landing of the fish. It gets dark before we actually land it. So if you want to watch that, skip to about like the seven minute mark or so. Um, that's where the most fun and exciting parts were of the video. But anyways, it just add another another tale to add to uh, Bob and I's fun fishing stories. So with that being said, you guys enjoy your day and enjoy the video, and I'll see you next time on the water. <laughs> But it went to deep water. I don't know. I've never caught a hybrid to see which way they go. Well, I'll tell you right now. If the rod goes, I ain't going with it. Very deep. I still got about 30 yards of line. Where are your cutters on any store? Uh, there's scissors and a cup holder. There should be in the cup, the cup, other cup holder, your cup holder. All right, guys, so we found out I got a giant spoonbill hooked up here. We're going to try and get it up to the boat and lasso its tail so I can get my crankbait back. And get one chance because once he decides to go, he's gone. <laughs> <Whoa. laughs> I think he's worn out. Did you lose the rope? No. <laughs> I told you, as soon as his tail... Yeah, it was dried up. <laughs> well, I bet you didn't think we'd catch this when we came out tonight. No. <laughs> yeah, we're almost back to where we started. 
It'd be fun to watch if you had the trail set up. He's worn out. Yeah, you're gonna have to stick your hands in the water and go up underneath his tail. I'll make sure the crankbait goes away from you and set it towards you. Okay, I'll pull. <laughs> you want me to do it? Because I know he's tired. He just he's just being stubborn. Like he just wants to go deep. Here, this might work out. That's a big fish. <laughs> I'm trying to get so his tail's up. I'm trying to get so if that crankbait pops out. <laughs> We're gonna get him in a second. <laughs> He's worn out though. Ugh. That's about as good as. <laughs> there you go. No, pull it tight. There. Now he's done. He's not coming off. Watch out. If he decides to go crazy, it could get bad. Alright, lights. Alright, shine some light. There we go. Just barely had him hooked. Right there. Wow. What a monster. Oh, easy does it, big boy. We're going to let you go. Hang on. Alright, let's let it go. Ugh. All right, guys, so this is a spoonbill. They're delicious, but they're out of season. So I'm gonna wait until he gets some. Oh, yeah, he's fighting me. Bye, buddy. That was awesome. <laughs> <laughs> that was worth it, just coming out tonight. <laughs> yeah, new tail for the Nick and Bob tails.